to touch on this I can tell you you're doing the Python data camp thing so you're looking at the data science stuff and you're getting really deep into Python do you see yourself becoming more of a developer yes I I was actually gonna touch on that because the way I am I'm a kind of person that when I like when I go into code Academy I look at all the courses there and I want to know it all <laughs> they're like which you one you want to pick yes <laughs> yes <laughs> I, I want I want to do it all. Like when I go to Linux Academy, I want I want to finish everything. I, but we don't have that much time, and and if you keep doing that, you're not gonna really master one thing. Mm -hmm. So sometimes I, I think um, sometime within this year, I I run a course on PHP on Code Academy. I learned JavaScript. I learned HTML. I learned CSS. I just so you, you 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 learned all the front end stuff. I just took our time and just finished it on Code Academy, but I understood that um, programming languages are just a tool because JavaScript and Python they they're basically doing the same thing, the same if else statement, the same function, the same classes. It's just a tool. It depends on what you're trying to achieve. So I thought about it. What I'm trying to achieve is being a network engineer, or maybe becoming a DevOps engineer. So Python better serves my purpose than learning all these other technologies. I saw you do that. I saw you kind of take a break and like look at Java and all that. I was curious what you were doing. Yes, that's, that's what I did. So like when you go to PHP, for example, you have an array, an associative array. And in Python, it's called a list and dictionary. So it's just people twisting things and having different languages. So.